Mr. Toad. I'll let her do something, Mr. Toad. Big B, before he completely <laughs> tears up the place. Hold on. Whoa, whoa, I whoa, hey, hey! You hey. got something on your face. Fuck are you talking about, you stupid Play with some nerds. <laughs> so my game is currently paused. <laughs> Recap. You're not as bad as this. everyone says you are. Please, Bigby. Promise me you won't tell Beast you saw me. I promise. That's what you got on your face, Thank big you guy. For trusting me. Have you seen my wife? I feel wife? like we should have definitely have you went seen to the beauty? husband first. Come with me. I do too. And not Mr. Toad. It's okay. I'm gonna do a second playthrough. Don't interrupt difference. me, Miss Snow! You asked me a question! Don't change the subject. You are to blame for this unpleasantness, Miss Snow. No, I'm D. He's dumb. But he said if word of this ever got back to him, if he ever thought you knew, or Miss White, he'd come back and kill more poor. I'm looking for the woodsman. Well, he's not here. Oh, you're out of paper towels in the... They're gonna string me up, Bigby. Like you said, it looks... Fucking bad. It looks really bad, but I didn't do it. All right, I got a hundred bucks for the first bloke that can tell me something about a girl name. Fuck, man. This fucking <laughs> lab dog. He comes sniffing around this place. The rich fucks and the women's need a <gasps> shakedown. Bring it to right, me, Billy. Now things are worse off well. than they've ever been. Well, that's not true. Right. We've had it worse, but not by much. Once the episode starts. Well, I just finished talking to Snow. Mine is currently loading. So, only a few seconds. You bet. Telltale Games presents Smoke and Mirrors, an association with Vertigo from DC Entertainment and Warner Bros. Oh, we're at the current team again. His face says it all. How could you murder Snow White? We're in interrogation. You're making right now. this more difficult than it has to be. If you We're just chef, cooperate you and answer the questions, you can go home. Maybe get some sleep. How are you feeling? I know it's been a long night for you. You look like you could use some rest. I'll be better when I, I finally did this. Which I can't do while sitting in here. We all want the same thing here, Big B. Look, I know what you must be going through. Really, I do. But I could use your cooperation. You know, I hate to say it, but I don't think you do. Of course. You're... you're right. I can't imagine what you're going through right now. Are they trying to blame us for this? What is it with you cops? They're trying to get They're information trying to out of us. Guys with people. I know this must be hard for you. Do you? Do you fucking know? Have you had a friend killed and their head left at your fucking doorstep? Honestly, yeah. No, you guys didn't have no idea. Didn't think so. Your nose is bleeding. so good. Detective Brannigan? I'm Detective Brannigan. Uh, yeah. I know. Is she poisoned or something? I just said that. What is wrong is with you, man? There's something. I think she was poisoned or something. Yeah. Oh, God. Please. Please. <laughs> I kind of want to see more of What is happening? Uh, I think the police outside passed out. Just make it stop, please. Because I feel like... What the hell just happened? 
Somebody please explain. <laughs> we have to go now. What, what did you, you do, do to her? She'll be fine. Out. It's just a memory this? wipe what spell. Happened? Very expensive, but it works. The whole station will forget the last 24 oh, hours and everything man. they saw at the woodlands. Well, That's mad yeah. shady. Why do you need a memory wipe spell, first of all, if we aren't interrogated? I don't know. That's, that's that's weird. She's playing some Wolf Among Us. Try to figure out who the hell killed Snow White. I hope you're doing good. <clears throat> that's an awkward car ride. I got that a crane. Yes, thanks for the bailout. Thanks out. for bailing me out. Hey, Crane Man. Certainly. What are you doing? We um bailed me out. We found but Tweedle I don't trust D chained up to a as post. As as you. It was your doing, correct? Yeah. Well, I don't know why you detained him. D was at the trip trap when Snow was left at the woodlands, so he couldn't possibly be involved in this mayhem. Bluebeard's currently interrogating him. He's, He's working, working for somebody. somebody. Whoever it is wants him snooping around every crime scene I've looked at. That doesn't necessarily mean they're involved in the murders. Defending them. Um, no, unfortunately, Ray you won't. But hopefully nice. next week well, or the week after that, we'll be coming back to regular I definitely gotta stop in yours I know more. what you're thinking, Big B. And check it out, It's been one full night and a slice of morning. And I but already I appreciate miss it too. you being here. You cheated her like crap, though. Do you know what I'm thinking? You know, I never get more homesick than when one of us dies. And now, for it to be snow, I'm That's never a little weird. These sorts of things. You were burned berating her. Just can't believe the last this is really happening. Her. Yeah, it's hard. Our stories used to be so simple. We had a beginning, Bernie, what's up? How are you doing? And an Happy Thursday. What's up, but ever Bernie? since we moved to this awful city, everything's gotten so confused. Did she um, give any indication to what she was thinking? Oh, of course. When you saw her last, I mean. I don't know why, but I'd like to know that I she like was... I like watching more streams, having more friends. Callous sometimes, right. but she wasn't really. She said that she wanted to change things, make it easier for Fables to get help when they need it. No, it's just a very... I know. I don't know what else to say, Bigby. We have to... have to put an end to this. It's been two murders in as many days. If we Meaning. don't unearth our culprit, and soon Take your there job, will likely be another on our doorstep tonight. I'll get it done. Don't say that. Please, Bigby. For Miss White. I got it. Oh god, we just cracked this man's window. <laughs> Ones I can trust the most with any. That's not a very good answer, is it? Come on. Ooh, just that? tell me what I want to know. It will make things a lot less painful for you. In theory. Oh, were you planning on using that? I just thought you really liked rubbing your little soul. Bluebeard, what are you doing? <laughs> what the hell do you think you're doing? Doesn't he sound Hello, like Lee's Kevon? character from The Walking Dead? He does. Sheriff? Maybe the same voice actor. Bluebeard, I was just chatting with our new friend. You were supposed to wait for us I to get back. To I told knife. you, if you want to be involved, you will do That's things why my I, way. I enjoy strength. No violence! Because I make a lot of friends, get to entertain the say, masses Kevon? that do come through. Hello, Big B. I want answers, D. Oh, goody. Oh, come on. I thought you wanted questions, up, and I was having so much trouble thinking you of any asshole. good ones. Though I'd settled on, how's your head? You uh, see what I've been dealing with? Like what are you going to do about we this, we Big B? Tend to stream it's been together. Hell, <laughs> but we're All not here to talk about me. Pretty much. Snow White is dead. Look, I oh, didn't that's cool. Here, Bernie has DLC going. And I'm supposed to just believe you. 
You were with me when it happened, dummy. I still have questions for you, D. Sounds I don't trust like a you, personal D. problem. This but yeah, we stream ridiculous. pretty much. Let him work. Together. He's got more experience with these kinds of things. Sometimes Why were you? No, I saw you at Faith's but apartment. That's very rare. What for were us. you doing there? Girls got air conditioning. You can't imagine what it's like living in a little shithole with no she air, does. especially with this on. heat wave going on. I'm not Sorry. fucking around here, D. That's the command. All right, D. Let's get to know each other. Oh, please don't hit him. Let's not hit him. Uh, what's, what's my command? Just let me go. What is this? Is it a picture? I could have sworn that was the command for you. I'm sorry, what happened? What's that you've got? Ah, uh, oh, Lisa, but yeah, no, it's not babe. Um, it's, it's babe. Fuck. Oh no, I did double X. Don't things. make me look at that. Stupid phone. Just put that away. There we go. Please. I knew I could get it. This is why we're here. Us. Someone killed this woman, and we need to know who. I get it. I do. But I can't tell you what I don't know. Just tell question. me what we you were doing him. at Faith's apartment. Look, I... Bigby, we're not on opposite sides. Oh, thanks for the My follow. brother and I are I trying to get you. to the bottom of things. Same as you. Shut up, Bluebeard. I got this. Your brother. Where was he last night? I can't say. What, does he have an alibi? He could have been anywhere. Take your best guess. He didn't do it, if that's what you're thinking. Then where is he? He didn't have an alibi. No, I'm not sending you after my brother. Look, I answered your question. Can I get my <laughs> Are you stuff doing these for the fall? I appreciate it. What did you, you find on him? Oh, uh, nothing of consequence, really. Ichabob's being mad shady here. Money and a scar. What can we do this to his hand? This will have him going no, in I'd... circles. He's getting somewhere. You always carry this much cash. I've got a lot of laundry to do this week. Maybe that's What's what I'm thinking. You? Uh, I'm debating between taking this money I'll or not. Get that I'll, I'll get to put it down. I'll be nice. I won't steal your cash. So where's your brother? Look, mate, I'd like to help. I would, but I can't it's tell cash. you where he is. Last time I saw him, we split up and I went to find Faith. I Ooh. don't know where he is now, but he didn't kill anybody. Just leave him out of what this. Did you want to you find? went to find Faith's what? Her apartment. I went to her apartment. That's no secret. You saw me. No, there's more to it. But why? You said you were trying to find something. All right, D. Since you never answered my Bluebeard. first question, Shut up. what did you want Let from Faith? Handle Sorry, shit. I can't help you. I'm not saying any more about it. What about your cigar? Okay. Are you? <laughs> I'm saving that. Here. I'll offer you a cigar. We'll get you to talk. Yeah, all right. Wanna see a trick? <clears throat> you know what, buddy? I'm gonna show you the picture of Snow White. That's what we're doing. Look, Big B. <laughs> this isn't going to work. Don't you want to find out Shut what up, happened Bluebeard. to those girls? To Snow White? Uh, let me on my turn. This. Come on, Dee. What did you want from Faith? Sweet girl like her. Sweet? You think that girl was sweet? She was a fucking thief. Fucking sweet. Faith was plenty of things, uh, but that ain't Did she steal from you? She stole from you. Why are you so angry? Not from me. She stole from my boss. Hell, I ain't got nothing worth taking. Your boss. Who's this boss of yours? So let's talk about your boss then. You're gonna get me in trouble. Maybe Bibi. she was. I can't answer any more of your questions. What if we give you a swig? I should be swig of this uh, whiskey here. Shut up, Bluebeard. <laughs> Just carry this Nobody's around. Nobody's talking to you. Always handy that way. I'll offer you a drink. Seems to it couldn't help. hurt, I guess.
Why don't you just tell me who you're working for? Look, you're not a bad guy. I believe Beauty on that one. But I can't give you that information. That's where I gotta draw the line. There's no way Beauty would associate with a scumbag like you. What's wrong with me? Did you take you're his You're telling money? me I ain't pretty enough? No, yeah, I didn't. we're ah, real I his money. close. I thought this was supposed to be a murder investigation, but you're treating this guy like a fucking house guest, Bluebeard! And not getting any answers from him this way. Snow White and you think is you did? dead. One of us. And you're going to let this ignorant shit walk out of here in one piece. Out of my way. I'll show you how it's oh done. My God. What the fuck? What do you think you're doing? Teaching him a lesson. Now pay attention. That's not how you right freaking now. teach a lesson. You enjoying yourself. Stop! What the <laughs> fuck do you think you're doing? Oh god, are we fighting, are we fighting him? Oh god! Oh god, oh, This is a What's going on down here? Look who's here! The one and only... Snow. Everybody can't even speak. I won't spell if you think you. Bluebeard, I'ma fuck you up, bro. I can't wait until you see this. Always listen to your music, though. It's so bomb. What the hell? I thought she was dead! <laughs> I told you, never underestimate it. I know, Sai Sai. What a freaking twist. That's what I love about this thing. But how are you doing, Sai Sai? Happy Tuesday. What a twist. Oh boy, what a, what a twist. beautiful twist. <laughs> you know, this music kind of reminds me of Law and Order. Yeah, me too. Just that hint of Law and Order. In finale soon. Oh, sweet. How's it going, Sai Sai? We were actually talking about that a little earlier. So, so Sai Sai, we we were reading up on uh, what is it? Uh, the quarry. What the so hell was going on down there? Reading up on it made me uh, you see that prison there's like potential that? that maybe we can all, me, you, and Elaine, can I do this story together. Snow. And that makes it okay. You can play it with us. Thinking. But I don't know. We gotta test that out. Oh god. I didn't mean to do it, Snow. I was trying to be nice. I hope it was worth your time. I had to beat his ass, Snow. I had to beat his ass. Sorry. Um, what? where the hell have you been? You really scared us. How are you not dead? Where, where have you been? Where the hell have you been all night, Snow? I was working on this case. After a conversation in the taxi last night, I got a call from Toad. He said his son found a body. We thought it was Faith at the time. Getting her back here wasn't easy, but hopefully we'll find something on her to help us track down the killer. Wasn't me. I'm glad I you took care of things. Bluebeard fucked him up. Thanks. Who did his body at this one? No, she never died, so, right? It's crazy, it? right? I'm glad you're uh, not dead. Me too. I just want to get to Has the bottom the of this. Yet? I just feel like... What is it? I just... I feel responsible in a way. She looked just like me. And maybe that's why she was killed. Not your fault. Not your fault. No, it's not your fault. But she looked just like me. That can't be a coincidence. We just have to find out who did this. And why she was glamoured to look like me. We'll figure it out. I mean, that's what it is, right? So, what's our next move? I'll figure it out, you should lie low. We Let's just keep, keep working doing on what this. we've been doing. We do our jobs. And I'm supposed to do what? Sit around the business office twiddling my thumbs? Waiting for the big bad wolf to solve all my problems? That's not oh, what, I what I meant. Well, then what did you Still mean? not your fault. I told you, I'm tired of sitting around. I'm, I'm not going to be life. an errand girl for Crane anymore. I just want you to be careful. 
I almost lost you once. I'm and... not yours to lose. Damn. Heartbreak right there. I'm sorry. I know it's dangerous, but I'm not helpless. I can take care of myself. I've I know doing you can. It centuries. It's dangerous. TJ is waiting inside. He was so freaked out last night, he wouldn't tell us much. Even now, he just stops talking altogether after a certain point. He's pretty shaken up, though, so try not to be too... you know. That's a douchey way to say it there, Snow. Myself. <laughs> Myself. Right. We'll be nice, Big B, for the, for the little kid. I love TJ. I wonder what TJ saw then. Let's figure out what TJ TJ's saw. TJ's over there. I don't know if you want to talk to him first or after, but let me know when you're ready to see figure the body. Figure out I, why the kid I is so shaking the hell up. Buffkin, do you have a second? Of course, Miss Snow. I can't... Uh, okay, so they're at the magic mirror. I'm going to wait a little bit. I kind of want to explore on the office. Pity these can't solve murders. Will we get different tarot cards, or will we still get the same ones we got before? Well, that's appropriate. Yeah, <laughs> I agree. The moon. Usually this is about deception or confusion, but for me, well, I want to look at the new fable I got. I had a new fable for that. I hope you can find Blue what you're looking last for. Wife. His mercy. And assets. Maybe this has been harder on him than I thought. I doubt it. Bottle. I have a perfume bottle. Snow's perfume. Very weird, guy. Why is there a perfume bottle? Um, I'm gonna go speak to Snow and Buffkin real quick before I talk to TJ. So, check out anyone who fits that profile. You might start with Bluebeard. Right away, Miss Snow. Let's go take a peek at the perfume bottle. Are you ready to examine the body now? In, In a minute. minute. In a minute. When Let you're ready. Go, let me talk to go, uh, see what TJ has to say before we go check the body. Why do you think I have to slam again? Be one day. Oh, that's enough. Uh, Mira, vanish! Cancel! No. What the hell are you doing? What? Right, let me I go wasn't talk touching to nothing. What's going on? You were speaking Don't worry, to the mirror. No, I'm done. Right, Big B? We'll talk about we'll this talk later. TJ. It's all right. Are you ready to talk to Mr. Wolf? Okay. Are you okay? Go ahead, TJ. I go swimming at night sometimes, in the river. I wasn't doing anything bad, I promise. Of course you weren't. We know you're a good kid, TJ. You aren't in trouble. You're not in trouble. Just tell me what happened. I was there, under the big blocks. And I heard noisy feet. And when I hear that, I'm supposed to go underwater and stay real still and quiet. That's right, son. Then I saw... I... I saw the lady! <laughs> I 
Bigby? Oh, he's Careful, scared Bigby. of us trying to comfort him. I wasn't. Him. I know. The lady fell in, but but she didn't have her head on. I uh, thought I, I thought she was gonna pull me down too. <laughs> cause cause she had rocks on her feet and she kept falling down in the dark parts. <laughs> Cinder blocks tied to her ankles. Is there more, TJ? That boy is, is traumatized. So you know Honestly, when people yeah. are lying. I heard you could do that. That's why you're the sheriff. Yeah, uh -huh. part of my job is being able to tell when people are lying. I'm really good at it. Is there something else you want to say? Please, don't be mad. What is it, TJ? I... I didn't stay under the water. What? I know I'm supposed to, but I was scared, and, and I went to the top again. I couldn't help it! I gave you very specific rules. You have to stay quiet and out of sight You're or bad trouble, things TJ. can happen. I told you! You're not in trouble. Like Ellie's not. Not this time, Toad. So you didn't stay underwater? I don't know if anyone saw me. But, but someone said, stop laughing. And then I was scared, and I went under for as long as I could. Wait, you heard someone? Yes. Why didn't you tell us before? Did Wait, you was someone hear laughing? anyone laughing? No. <laughs> Did you see Did anybody? you see who it was? Did you hear anything else? I don't know. I don't know. I'm sorry. I feel so bad for him. After I came up again, there was no one there. And I ran home. That's all. I promise. I want to go home. <laughs> okay. You can go. <laughs> Thank you, TJ. Okay, son. <laughs> Let's get you home. You did a good job, kid. Come on, then. That went about as well as I expected. <sighs> you want to go look at the body now? Yeah, wait, actually, in a minute, in I want to see the mirror. When you're ready. I feel so bad for TJ. He's got to be traumatized after seeing that. That kid is a good kid. Just very traumatized he is. now. After both incidents. Unfortunately. I wonder if we could see what uh, Toad was looking at. Hey, mirror. Hello, Big B. Nice to see you. What were you showing Mr. Toad and his son? Cinderella selling shoes. I wanna talk Rapunzel, to the mirror. Rose, and of Just course, like Elaine wants you. to talk to the mirror. And I can't I help note that you did not <laughs> rhyme. Do try to stick to the rules next time. Yeah, I'll do that. Uh, show me Where can I find Tweedledum? Uh, that piece of scum. <laughs> He's in a car. He looks really freaking creepy from here. Okay, how about the, the woodsman? and I were fighting. Now I want to know where he's hiding. Well, that's helpful. He's just shaking again. Okay, I think we got all that we could from the mirror. How's everybody's week going, guys? Any plans for the weekend? <laughs> Show me Tweedledum. He looks really creepy in that angle. <laughs> also, I'd like you to get me some information on this neighborhood watch program that the Mundies have. 
I believe I already have some pamphlets on file. You want to go look at the body? Alright, now? now I can go down to wherever we need to go see yeah, the body. Yeah, let's do this. Yeah. Now. Oh my goodness! I almost forgot. Come on. Don't you forget? Forget it, Buffkin. The Witching Well, Jeep. Okay, we can explore here. I've never seen a well in real life that I can remember, at least. Must be really scary falling into one. Evidence box. I know there was something on the ground over here. You know, I, I don't know why I never realized you had more emotes. Oh yeah, I ended up um, using a couple of the follower ones. I'm in the process of trying to create some. I did not notice. <laughs> I. It's wearing the same outfit. Wow. I didn't realize... Are you gonna be okay? You don't have to stay. I want to stay. I'll be fine. It's just... a little... strange. The glamour is so effective, it's... invasive. But... just do what you need to do. Um, let's check... Check her mouth. There might be a ribbon in there, like before. Anything? Nothing. Can you close her mouth? Thanks. It looks just like Faith's dead. But there was nothing in her mouth this time. Do you think it was done by the same? You person? just asked me to check her mouth. Then you Did asked Dr. me to Swinehart close it. Dr. Swinehart ever get back to you about Faith? No. He said he wanted to run more tests. That's weird. I don't wear a brooch like that. Maybe it really belonged to her. Not part of the glamour. Looks like something from the homelands. Buff can find you find out recognize who these symbols? No, nothing I've seen before. Oh, her legs are like scratched up. Rope marks. She was tied up? They tied cinder well, blocks wasn't to she... her ankles. So she would sink. Oh. Track marks. She used Monday drugs? It looks that way. Sink Pretty away. Too. I hear they only go for the legs if they've used up the veins in their arms. Or if they're trying to hide the marks. Wait. If the glamour is supposed to make her look like me, shouldn't it be concealing things like track marks? And that brooch, too. Why would it change everything else? I've never seen one this sloppy. It might be failing. failing. Glamours don't just fail. The witches upstairs know what they're doing. That's why they cost so much. Unless someone is making glamours illegally. It's not Possibly. technically illegal. Flowers. It's not encouraged for sure, but there aren't any laws specifically forbidding it. So there's some sort of black market for glamours? One would assume so. I imagine anyone with access to the proper books and training could theoretically produce a glamour. Yet another thing to worry about. Black market or not, yeah. it's a pretty good match. Look at that. The buttons aren't exact either. There's an extra one here. Wait, what's in her hand? Her fist is clenched. So she fought back? No marks on the knuckles. Oh, oh she's holding something. Maybe she was grabbing something? I probably Maybe. opened her hand. Oof.
Yeah, I'm gonna do what it. What are you doing? To be evidence. I'm sorry. Out. Could be something used Jesus, on for our investigation. What is it? Flowers. Yeah. Today's been pretty good, Bernie. A little bit tired from work, but I was kind of happy you got to um, come home You're early. Right. How about you? These buttons are wrong. I wonder. Early. I don't know if we nice. should have it. Um, mind so, if I open mind if I, um, open her coat? Bigby, just let me do it. You still okay? I... Sorry, that uh, took longer than expected. Oh, great. What have you found out? Egg. She was using Monday drugs. Pretty heavily, too. Judging by the track marks on her legs. Track marks? Isn't there... Uh, there are diseases... I don't think she has to worry about that now. No. No, of course not. A weird question. We should Russians keep going. also sus. She's wearing some lingerie. Perfume. Snow's perfume. Use what this. Is that? What the hell? It's your perfume. How do you know what perfume I wear? You can't fool us. Well, we have good senses. Also, I saw the <laughs> bottle on your desk. Looks like someone picked it out for her. So, someone gave her instructions. Very creepily. Is there anything else in her pocket? I've seen things like this before. It's definitely be magic. You. The witches don't usually craft objects these days. I don't think it's wise to fool around with that. It's some kind of black market magic. Who knows what it could do? We should have it looked at. Just to make sure it isn't dangerous. Don't you think? Um, you may be let's right. find out. One way to find out. His eyes are saying something else. Uh, what? There's something in here. How do we open it? I think I, I can, can figure, figure it out. out. Something to do with these rings here. Gotta put them together? An animal of some kind of animal. I think a horse, maybe. Or deer. Oh god. Oh, I gotta get to the last ring here. The deer. Yeah. A deer. What does that mean? Oh. Here in a photo. When did they get this lock? Is that? It's your hair. I feel so bad for Snow. That's like such a big invasion of privacy. Mm, very invasive. Someone must have taken this from my apartment. I That's noticed creepy. it was missing, but I didn't think. This was the last picture I had of Rose and me. My sister and I don't talk much anymore. Who did this, Big P? Oh! The glamour I think is wearing off. She's a troll? You gotta be kidding me. Alright, calm, down, calm down. It's not like you haven't seen a troll before. Who is she? Hey, is that she related to the bartender? Before. Who do you think she is? I oh my god, what is the sister that's missing? Should have left them all back in the homelands. She looks like Holly. The owner of the trip trap? No, she looks a little... 
Oh no. What is it? It's not Holly. I think it's, it's her sister. Her sister knew Lily. it. She was reported missing, but I, I guess it just slipped through the cracks. We have to go tell Holly. Right. Who knows? Um, she might know something about this. Who Lily was seeing. Brain, why are you so troll. quick to answer? You're being sus. We should go. You can't go out there. Why not? It's too dangerous. Someone tried to kill you. Bigby, you can't let her go out there with you. You'd be putting her I'm life at risk. I'm gonna say Bigby is not it's up to her. If Snow wants to come with me, uh, yep. I'm not gonna stop. Yep, Crane, but it ain't your choice to decide whether now. she comes with me or not. Yeah. Bitch. And I don't trust her here with him either. He's very sus during that whole investigation. Crane is a sus boy. Honestly. Look, now you're a couple of seconds ahead of me. <laughs> this whole thing is What's complete that? bullshit and always has been. I mean, what's his job, really? To keep shit oh from God, reaching the sour. woodlands. Jack, I don't know where they are. You're a bar. You're supposed to have darts Just around. Just checking normally do, but who knows where the fuck they went to after... Uh-oh. Come on, Holly. I need entertainment. This'll do. Can we just talk to Holly peacefully? Holly, you got a minute? Why? Please, Holly. It's important. Miss White! I heard you had kind of a strange morning. It's been kind of a strange morning for everyone, I think. Every time I see this guy, he seems to lose weight. It's amazing. It really is. He loses weight and yet somehow keeps all the muscle. Jack. Wolfie, my dear, how are you? <laughs> because, you know, we were just talking about you. Jack, I'm all punch of us. You in the face. At the bar, here. I just need to talk to Holly. Privately. All right, just give us a second first. I'm dying to hear about the body that came out of the East River this morning. It was a fable, right? Oh, everyone knows. Tweedledee was just here. He said it Wait, looked like Snow don't White. Don't you mean Sure it wasn't Tweedle Dumb? Well, no, but he seemed pretty sure. Crane. Sorry. Tweedledee said you arrested him for no earthly reason. Kept him locked in the cellar all fucking night. He said you tortured him. Which, I don't know, that seems like a breach of your legislative duties. Bigby, come on. You can't be so dumb as Jack, to... find the off button. Now! What is it with you two? Well, we didn't torture him. You and Gran are all, mostly. let's get a posse together when there's no one around. But as soon as the big bad wolf walks in, your tails go between your legs. Cat got your nerve. What happened? What happened? I'm tired is what happened. Tired of what? Of trouble, Jack. I'm sick and tired of trouble. I don't want any more. Jack. What? Bigby, look. Two fables are dead. And shit, Gren's sister... Holly's sister. Holly's sister has been missing for what? A few days now? And we haven't heard word one about it from anyone. Actually, well, that's what we have came there here. been any updates? I don't know be how to say this to you, Holly. The woman we found in the river. Who was it? You know who it was. I feel so bad for all. Boy, I sure walked into that one. If you say one more fucking thing, Can we just, just throw one him more out, thing. Please. God fucking damn it! Of course, the dear princess Snow fucking White is all safe and sound. Where were you when we reported this weeks ago, huh? Where are you when we ever fucking need you? If you'd give one ounce of a shit about her, about any of us, she might have been saved. She might have been cared for. She might have been... I'm sorry, Holly. I'm sorry we found your sister this way, and... I... I wish this had ended up better. No, Snow, I don't know if you should do that. 
I feel for Holly in this situation. Just gotta get her from this. Just backups now? Holly, get the fuck out of my bar. I just want It should have been you. It should have been you, and it wasn't. I don't wish she on anybody. It just be hurting. So kind. We recovered this from her personal effects. Yeah, I'm sure. I thought you might like to have it. I I didn't know she still had this. <sighs> the copper was from a Come drift on. mine. You go to Jack. That was decent of you. Grin. Yeah. Take off for a bit, would you? Are you sure? I'm glad that she has a little bit of trust now. Jack's gotta go, though. My god. Jack got on my nerves a little bit. I don't know that much about her life, honestly. We didn't talk often. Mm. She was lost here in the city. She just got swept away by it. Why, Why were you weren't two you guys talking? Not talking. It seems so fucking petty now, but I just I didn't want to watch it with her. I think she was off the Monday drugs, but she was hooking to pay down debt. It ate me up to see her that way. Eventually, the only people she owed were at her work. You know, that shithole club, the pudding and pie. The owner, Georgie, with all his fucking fees. It's a crock of shit. That's how they kept her under their thumb, really. Holly, it's okay. If it's too much, we but don't fees. have to do this. Fees, huh? What kind of fees? Sounds like one of those old company store kinds of ploys, designed to entrap people by keeping them in debt. We can probably learn more at the club. Stupid. We've got a lead. Maybe we can take it from here. <laughs> Lily. Thanks for everything, is there Holly. Is there um is there anything we can do to No. No, I'm better off dealing with things alone. I don't need sympathy and I don't need charity. It's not charity. It's looking out for our own. Is she? Where is she? She's at the business office. She's taken care of. I'm gonna have to go down there and get her. Fuck. Please, we can handle the funeral arrangements. No, no, it's it's a kind of... It, it's a formality with trolls. Thanks, Stop. We burn our dead by sunrise or... I don't know. Of course. Okay, good. Let's go down to the business office and start making the necessary preparations, all right? Down to the pudding and pie we go. Oh, I feel so that club. I'll go down there now. See what I can find out from the owner. You were good with her. I'm impressed. <laughs> really, thanks. It just made everything easier. Ah, uh, the destruction mids. had one of those ribbons on her neck. Do you think she worked here? Hmm. Maybe. Oh. Sheriff, what a nice surprise. I'm not sure I've seen you here before. We shall You're find You're always welcome, oh. of course. Is it business or pleasure? Or both? Um, I've got some questions for I've Georgie. I've got some questions for Georgie. Straight to business this time, then. You're in luck. He's here. Come on. I 
should warn you that Georgie does not like to be bothered when he's working. And he's in kind of a mood right now. It'll be well, fine. I have a way with people. I have a way with people. <laughs> so I've heard. Welcome to the Pudding and Pie, where we cater to the diverse tastes of the Fable community. Your pleasure is our pleasure. Did you know Lily? She worked here? <sighs> My lips are sealed. You'd better ask Georgie. That's what fate said to you. But you're sealed. Oh god. I forgot about this. What do you think you're doing? Hello there, George. You look like you're trying to take a shit. Who's gonna want that? No one's gonna want that. Nice place. You do have a sense of humor. That's good. Good luck. Oh boy. It's your face. I'm gonna investigate you smile. Talk to you never quickly. smile. How many times do I have to s Oh great. That I though. Oh! You. <laughs> I know what so I said. We're closed. Keep dancing, you. I didn't say stop. My Georgie, you must slap For fuck's sake. You, stay right there. Don't even think about sitting down. I got a few questions. Imagine my excitement. What do you want then? You here for a little taste? Tell you what, come back after midnight, maybe. I can hook you up. Oh my god. Or, uh, knowing you, this is probably not quite your style. You'd prefer someone who can take a bit of a beating. Tell me, do you prefer a stationary target or one that will put up a fight? I'm not here for that. Oh, I'm not here for that. <laughs> you just stopped in for the chips then. Jesus, Big B, you're so corny. I love it, though. No, seriously, I love it. So what'd you hear? Okay, all right, Sheriff. Just fucking with you. Look, I know why you're here. Are you sure? sure? Listen, Sheriff. Around here, we can't afford to wait for you and your swanky pals to take an interest. We have to look out for each other. When shit happens, I hear about it. Especially if it concerns my livelihood. In that case, I assume you knew Lily was glamoured. Of course she was, you daft git. She was a troll. No. I mean glamoured to look like another fable. Yeah? Well, so what? Who gives a toss? People get up to all kinds of things when nobody's watching. It's really sick, It's though. sick. Ha! Ah, that's quaint. Especially coming from you. The 13th floor would never provide a glamour like that. Strictly black market stuff. Ooh, black market, is it? How exciting. This is exactly what I would expect from a thug like you. Storm in, throw around a bunch of accusations, try to scare people. But you've got fuck all to back it up. And we're all just meant to jump any time the wolf shows his teeth. Nothing to back it up? Well, what the fuck is this, then? Get that out of my face. Georgie, I found it I'm on Lily's body, and it's definitely a back alley job. Where did she get it? You've got this all wrong. If Lily was doing a special glamour, it wasn't for me. For fuck's sake, I want that kind of eat. Who was she doing Honestly. it for, then? From she had clients, maybe. Bigby. Maybe one of them was into it. A lot of fucked up people in Fable Town. Like who? Try looking in the mirror. Anyway, now what to do with me? Wouldn't he know who the clients are? Yes. I'm about to turn anyway. off that radio. I feel so bad for the girl here. I'm turning it off. They're not done. You're gonna hit me. Go ahead. That's what you want to do, right? One more time. Who hired her? Oh my god. Okay. Well, <laughs> he screwed oh, himself no, over. Oh fuck. You! Take your sad fucking face where I can't see it! Bloody bastard fucking shit! 
You proud of yourself, mate? Proud of your little mess? Fuck's sake. Fuck up, Hans. Hold on a minute. Hans, is it? Hans just cleans up and provides a little muscle when we need it. He's not going to know anything about the girls and their clients or any of that. No one knows. Don't you get it? It's by design. Discretion is our guarantee, right? And the way we guarantee that is that no one knows anything they don't have to know. Including me. I cover my eyes and take my cut. End of story. Why yeah, not why look it up? People... What's that? Isn't there a little book with all the stuff about the girls and all that written in You're it? You're a fucking moron! Show Thank me. you, Hans. There is the freaking no boss moron. book. And as for you, Hans, we need to work on your communication skills and have a fairly good idea where to start. Hey, that's my personal problem. Don't make me smash this boombox, buddy. Tell me about the book. <laughs> sure, go ahead. Do what comes naturally. Oh my god. <laughs> Tell me about the book. You haven't got the slightest clue about anything. Hey, now! Want the book. Cut the crap, Georgie. I want the book Hans is talking about. Hans is confused. Again. Don't even think about it. Have you broken up his, uh, club? No, have you? <laughs> Look, no, Georgie. Why don't you just tell me where the book is? Can I we really please not go round and round about this? I really There's want no to smash book. Boombox. End of story. Do not touch that. You hear me? That's nothing to do with you. There's still time for you to just cough it up. I'm sorry, Sheriff, but there's no Andy Magic book with everything you want to know jotted down inside. I sincerely wish there was. Maybe it would get you off me back. Ooh, what do I see here? Well, well, what's this? Looks like a floor safe. Uh, I wouldn't know. It was here when we moved in. I don't have a key to it. Sheriff, will you I come on? You. Fuck's sake, I've got to open up in a few hours. Give me the damn book, Georgie. Give it to me. You're a big bad bastard. We get it. Everyone's guilty. We fucking get it. Jesus, you're killing me. I'm begging you. I'll pay you. Two women are dead. Then quit being a bloody idiot. Come on, Nate. Leave it. I didn't There's nothing there for one you. One piece of your property, bitch. You might want to stand back. All right, all right, all right. Yeah, to do. Bloody come on, then. Prick. Once again, don't get your hopes up. There's nothing in here that'll tell you anything. It's a kick to the balls for me and my club, so he can be happy about that. I mean, if you could help save a freaking life. Here, this is Lily's last entry. So tell me, Georgie, who's this Mr. Smith? Oh dear. I'm afraid it might be a fake name, Bigby. Secrecy is sort of how this all works. Even Hans knows that. What's two oh seven? Room, number, room number? I don't fucking know. Millimeters, maybe? Don't bullshit me, Georgie. This is your book. Your girl. I'm not their fucking secretary. I give them a stage. I give them music. I provide an erotic venue to attract and retain clients. But let's be clear on something. The girls make the arrangements with their clients, not me. The girls. They're the ones with the Mr. Smiths and Joneses and Mr. X types. Whatever happens outside the club, that's on them. I log the Let's business, to the girl, take then. my cut, and I'm out. Now, I've had quite enough of you and your bullying. Excuse me while I call your superiors to make a complaint. 
About what? We didn't even break up your freaking club. I'm gonna go Hello. talk to the person that opened this office. door. Me too. You can't complain, we didn't do anything. Lock's been busted open. Broken open, but there isn't even a lock. Lipstick, lip gloss, compact, glitter. Faith. Is that a note on the floor? Faith, thanks for covering for me tonight. Let's talk before you go over to the apartment. Lily. Looks like they Search both saw one of Lily's clients. For what we need to see. I examined all the cubbies. Excuse me. I guess it's time to go over here. I heard you out there. I don't remember ever seeing you here before. Um, I'm, I'm here, here now. now. Yes. Is that Fate's color? She also has a ribbon on her. You're trying to play. Who me. are you, young lady? They used to call me the Little Mermaid. Oh my god, is Ariel. Once upon a time. Does that help? What are you doing? Ariel. What are you doing here? Same as anyone. It's a place where I am. Where else am I supposed to be? You just saw Ariel's boobs. Oh my god, <laughs> I just, just realized that. My name is Nerissa. Well, Nerissa, I've got some questions. Of course you do. I don't have answers. You'll have to find those yourself. Do you have Does the number 207 mean anything to you? I assumed it was a room number, but where? We can't talk about work. This is a murder case. I mean can't. These lips are sealed. Discretion is our guarantee. You think they were cursed or something and that's why their lips it's are sealed? It's how things work here. People keep using those phrases. What does it mean? Think they were this is what I need to know about. Lily's last entry. Who's Mr. Smith? Where's room 207? I have to know. These lips. Sheriff Wolf, would you like to make an appointment with me? I'm going to say okay. I feel like okay. she's trying to help us, but she can't. What would I need to do? I need 150. It's not good to be short. Crap, I didn't take his money. I don't have the money. I'm kind of broke. Sorry. Wait here for a second. Good thing I stole. D's money. Not enough to pay her. I think they're cursed, and that's why they can't speak. Because you saw the way that she was like forcing herself to say something. Yeah. Could be the ribbons. Room two hundred four. Two hundred seven. Yeah, I think so too. You'll think it's close something. to it. The open arms. You. Hmm. This is where they met. Enjoy your stay. I hope you find what you're looking for. I hope so too, Ariel. I do not want to see you in number three or any that fact. Me either. I don't want to see her become body number three. So we're going to the open arms. 
which is next door. There's a Where few a cop just there. came out of. Hey there, pal. So, this looks like it's kind of a secluded area for people that don't want to be found out. I wonder how we're going to get to see room 206. Hmm. Me too. We got 204, but we don't have 207. So, nobody's at the little desk. Think we can get the keys? The bell. Let's look at the sign for having the bell. Might as well look at everything like before. Lobby. They should cut their rates. Dummies. You Want it by the hour or for the whole night? Oh my god. What are you doing here, beauty? I work here, okay? Mm? I work the front desk. It's to I'm help pay rent. Around. Beauty's so, here. Now you what know. She doing here? I know I should have told somebody, but Beast would lose his mind if you knew. Beast is a proud man, Bigby. He wants to do right by me, and he, he just couldn't handle Beast, it if he knew I had beauty? to do this so we don't get evicted. You should really tell Beast. He's worried about you. I will, I will. I just need to in my own time. By the way, thanks for covering for me. So, what are you doing here? Oh, you have a key. Someone else was murdered last night. I heard. The victim was someone who worked at the Pudding and Pie, Lily. She, uh, come around here ever? Oh, oh, yes, the, the troll. I did see her. I mean, you know, we never really spoke, but she came off a tad intimidating. Hey, did you ever see Lily? Uh, did you ever see Lily with anyone? Ever see Lily with someone here? Maybe on a job? Sometimes, but nobody I've recognized. I haven't worked here that long, though. How about a room register? Or someone named Mr. Smith? <laughs> That's all we get here. Smiths, Jones, or Johnsons. I think the last ones are jokes. <laughs> Did you know Faith? Ever meet a girl named Faith? Or just maybe hear that name? I might have. I don't know. By the end of the night, it's, it's kind of a blur with all the names. Tara, Brandy, Amber, Heather... Sorry. Have you seen Snow White down here? Or maybe somebody glamoured as her? You know, it's funny. I did see someone who I thought looked a lot like her, but she didn't say anything when she saw me, even though she knew that I saw her. I just assumed it wasn't Snow and went about my business. Now what about Tweedledee? I talked to Tweedledee earlier today. He mentioned you in passing. Do you know him? his brother I took out a loan for back pay it was like our third notice and ever since then those annoying freaks have been pestering me for the money plus interest why take out a loan from those two it was from the crooked man beauty you don't know how desperate I was Bigby I had nowhere else to go look if this ever happens again come see me or snow first all right I tried that's not my fault, okay? Sorry. Thanks. Wait. It'll be better if anyone sees you, that they at least see you with me, so they know that I didn't let you just wander around by yourself. Oh crap, I hope Beast isn't here or something. Watching Five us together minutes, in a hotel room? Please. We'll see, beauty. Just be ready to act like I'm trying to kick you out. That won't be hard. <laughs> Listen, Bigby. I assume you'll be filing some kind of an official This one is running fast. Which is fine. It's just that I was wondering if I need to be in it. Do you have to mention my name? I mean, it's it's not like Beast would ever see your report. It's just I got to tell the truth. It's not much of a report if I start picking and choosing which facts to include. I see. Well, can only go here so we far. Are. Which one was it? Okay, 
let's open this. Alright, this ain't the room I need, Never beast. Sure have Beauty. In a place wow. like this. Beauty beast. You get health inspectors through here very often? I don't know. <laughs> what do you think? <laughs> All right, I'm gonna... Finding what you're looking for? I wasn't expecting much in here. But isn't this why you're here? Why you have the key? No, not really. The key was just to be sure I found the right hotel. This isn't the room Lily was using. Oh. Go to 207 Beauty. So are we done now? No, the room they met in was 207. Right, 207 it is. Uh, I'm gonna knock. You have keys to these rooms? I thought you had a key. Not to this one. I don't one. know if me going on, into baby. every room I can't just matters. let you go into any room you want. Seriously, what if someone found out? I could get into a lot of trouble. Please. Oh, fine. Oh, well, thank you. Of <laughs> surprise, please worked. Well, that's weird. Oh no, that's not. I'm not ready. Right supposed about to open every either. room it's in the, the building. Room, but I just want to walk in every room. Like Beauty. So. Uh oh. Beast. Uh oh. How could you do this to me? It's not no, what you think. No. Wait a minute. How could you do this? We've been together through everything! I took care of you! I love- It's not what you think! Please! You're cheating on me! With no. him? No! No, we're not! No, Beast! I promise I'm not! I'm helping him, that's all! I'll bet! Oh, I'm God. sure you help each other just great! I know what this place is! This is a murder investigation. She's helping me- Stop lying to me! What the fuck is wrong with you? She's my wife! Beast, listen to me! Stop There's nothing see. going on! I'm mad! Ah! Hey! Oh, Bastard! I guess I finally see you for who you are! Stop! Stop it! You told me you hadn't seen her, you fucking liar! Listen Talk to, to your, your wife. wife. Just calm down and- Beast! Can't resolve everything ah! in five minutes. Oh. Okay! Ah! Okay, ah! well then. What the hell do you think you're doing? You aren't even listening to me! <laughs> I don't my want to hurt you! Me. I told- <laughs> Not what you freaking think, dude! Calm down! Stop! I don't want to do this, beauty! Trust me! Please! <laughs> Leave him be! This is my fault! I don't want to hurt you. God. Oh, fucking God. I'm so sorry, Beast. Can I not hit you? Bigby, no! Don't hurt him! He's had enough. He's had enough. Let's pause the minute. Yeah, it paused for me too. I'm you sorry. You ruined I everything. I think it's just my thing. fucking what? You, it's not what you freaking think, dude. <sighs> Shit, Bigby. What have you done? Well, I'm not gonna finish hitting him. What? What then is he's gonna this? hit me. Big B. What you asshole. did to the door! You can't just act like this whenever Stand you- Stand back! You, you don't God, want to see look this. look at the blood and the freaking flowers. This, I hope she doesn't see this. This is horrible. The Beauty, outside. stay in the hall. What? Why? What's going on? <gasps> oh my God! Don't touch anything. Is this- Is this- Lily met her client here. Mr. Smith, whoever he is. And then- Must have happened right here. 
Jesus. Last night? Yeah? I was on shift last night. On shift? Beauty, what? I'm not a prostitute, you um, idiot. I work the front desk. Is it a she had in so the rented this room. Do you remember who rented this room last night? I don't think anyone did. Not last night. Maybe they have it long term. I don't know. How am I supposed to know? It just seemed like a totally normal night. How is that even possible? There's so much blood. Go lock the front door. Keep people out of the hallway. I need you to be sure no one comes in here. This is a crime scene, okay? But Just do what he says. I'll explain later, okay? I feel so bad for Beast. I hope he, he comes to understand, though. Bigby, what kind of a person could do something like this? That's exactly what I'm about to try to find out. A I pass. can't believe this. I appreciate you, though. There is a lot of blood. Do all the rooms have these same clocks with a built-in cassette player? I think so, yes. Um, I don't... What is this actually? An apple? Do you smell something? No. Just apple. This is a wild story. Look, a bite out of an apple. This is Snow White's story. We shouldn't even be in here. I knew it. What is that? It's a book about Snow White. Or about the Monday version of her story, anyway. Beautiful, it says. I mean, if Beauty and Snow don't want him, Bigby, I am available. <laughs> I feel that. <laughs> Bigby's a great <laughs> dude. The Sorry, I was reading chat. about her? Who's being with Sasa? I was saying. What is it? Nobody wants Bigby. He likes to see Snow and Pearl. He made Lily bite the apple. I think the apple is part of his fantasy about Snow White. That would explain the one we found on the floor. Oh no! Do you think it was poisoned? It was not. Beauty, I please. That. Just, I think just it's just relax. a prop. It's here because they were acting out the scene in the book. Of course, that makes perfect sense. They were acting Sexy. out the thing with her stepmother and the apple, <laughs> which is really creepy when you think about it. You know, she almost died when... Uh... Was she breathing? Why is she in a glass coffin? This is the part where she's in a deep sleep, Whoever but killed they her think she's dead. Smokes the same brand as Mr. Bigby here. It's a huff and puff. I thought you were the only one who smoked that crap brand. Apparently not. What if they're trying to frame us? <sighs> he brought wine. Classy. I'm getting something for my arrival. Hey, I'm gonna look at the bed Just now. Unbelievable. like she was lying down when she was killed. Flowers were already here. How do you know that? Blood pattern. Also, I'd say the body was dragged off the foot of the bed. Wow. There. The body. Jesus. You could say she. Poor girl. I just can't even imagine. Kill you, beauty. Hmm. What? What are you thinking? Flowers mean a personal connection reminds me of Snow's coffin looks like a ritual sacrifice. It reminds me of the Bigby. coffin. It looks like Snow's coffin from the book. He's reenacted the scene with her lying here, surrounded by flowers. Mr. Smith put Lily to rest here. You're right. It fits. He's acting out scenes from the book. That poor girl. Hey, the dress. There's a dress in the closet. I didn't get a chance to look she at it. She couldn't have known. She probably just needed the money. She could have been anyone. How did she wind up here? I mean, not exactly here, but 
Just how does a person... We can't really we know. Can't know the answer to that. Every situation is different. Yeah. Uh, I'm gonna see if I can put she the tape in before I open so the closet. Scared. my arrival oh my god oh my god this it's exactly sick, sick what freaking snow white would listen to with all the little birds and anything chirping from Big the story this, i think i heard this music last night it was playing pretty loudly for a while and then stopped in the middle I didn't think twice about it at the time. I, I mean, you hear all kinds of Sucks, things around I here. I guess I've already gotten used to blocking them out. Could have covered okay, up I the love you. Of the oh my god. Maybe she didn't button. see it coming. <laughs> Probably sneezed too hard. And then here's Snow White's gown from the book. Someone's been rough with this dress. It's torn. Oh no, she must have been wearing it. He killed her and then, and then he took it back off? No, there's no blood on it. It must have been torn some other time. Weird. Can we, can we find oh, no, DNA on this? What? What now? He could be a cross, it has like a snow Picture costume. Of snow. It looks like this a snow costume. the same costume. dress as the one in the book about snow. I think Smith was dressing Lily up in it. To recreate the snow from the book. <laughs> I know You're what right. you mean. It's the same dress. It's another match to what's in the book. God, I can see the whole picture now. It, it all goes together like you said. This creep put that girl in a snow white dress and, and recreated the whole story from the book with the apple and, and the deep sleep and everything. You're a better detective than I thought you'd be. Thanks. Yeah, so planned it all out. Like that he had all the details noted down. Only then, when it comes time to kiss her and wake her up. Yeah, that's a that's a twist. I hope you're just I about through. Expect. I don't really want to stay in here any longer. I think I know what you're talking about. I haven't gotten there, but I'm pretty sure I know. What a bastard! Pictures of the dead girl? Not all of them. How do you know? I'm in this one. It was taken last winter. Oh no. Bigby. This kind of stalking, it doesn't just stop by itself. Trust me, I know about this firsthand. He'll keep trying to get closer and closer. His stand in for snow is gone now, so. The next step closer. What is it? It's <gasps> Crane. Sick bastard. I knew he was watching us through the freaking mirror. Well, well, well. We found our freaking serial killer. Oh, no, don't smash the freaking mirror. You douchebag. Next time on The Wolf Among Us. That was wow. He could be after you now. Good. I am dying to get my hands on that disgusting weasel. Did he leave town? I'm really starting to like you, Sheriff. You're not afraid to be a complete bastard. Obviously, there will have to be some changes. Even Captain's having a hard time with the, okay, the, uh, Hello, the song Big question. Take care of it, Bigby, or I'll take care of it for you. Jesus <laughs> it's a hard question. Christ, Bigby. Oh my god. Is that full you? Full force. 